Hey everybody, so uh, in this video or this series of videos I'm going to walk you through how to create a search engine for your website. Now uh, unlike the earlier video I did on creating a search engine, this is not going to look for exact spelling matches, in fact this is going to use a, almost like a phonetic approach to matching. So for example here, here's our basic search engine, um, if I search on say the word quick, it returns an exact match for quick in these two records. But I don't actually need to be totally accurate. Quick QWK also returns that. And we can do that with multiple words. So if I say quick fox, it returns both the things with quick in it and fox, but also those things that only have fox in them as well. So not only is it doing some kind of phonetic matching, um, it's also able to search on both words both together and also separately. Now uh, in terms of the setup and how what we're going to walk through here, and it's a four video series at the moment, uh, we're going to have our database, if I can find it in there somewhere, here we go, there'll be two tables in there, one table uh, will just have the actual text that is uh, displayed, so this, this is kind of like the content would be on your website, and our other table is actually the metaphone or phonetic equivalent of it, and you can see here this is um, using the PHP metaphone function. Uh, this, this is quick brown fox, you can see KK for quick, BRN for brown, and FKS for fox. And you can see that is actually matching um, the ID 2 here, and that is the second record, or whatever has an ID of 2 in our text table. So if I go back to text, you can see there is quick brown fox with a text ID of 2. So they're sharing a common key. So uh, what we'll be doing when we run our search is we'll actually be running a metaphone function over the search criteria, so whatever the user enters, we'll look for a match in our metaphone text table. If we find it, we then go to the ID of that particular text, and then we return to the text table, and we'll return the actual content. And in terms of what we'll be creating, obviously we'll have a search page and a search results, uh, and we'll also go through how to actually add text um, to to it, so if I say um, if I put hello world into our database, uh, that will then enter text into it, and in our database here, you can see hello world is entered. But not only that, hello world phonetic equivalent is also entered into the metaphone text table. So that's what we'll be covering. Uh, we'll be covering how to do the entering, how to do the search, how to set up the tables, and um, also how to avoid duplicate results in our search results. So um, there's a whole bunch of stuff, it'll take another three videos from this point on, and um, this is my second go at recording this because for some reason um, the software I've been using was bringing all sorts of feedback and noise, so hopefully this has worked really well. Anyway, I hope you stick with me, it's a, uh, it's a really cool little idea this, so um, have a watch. 